This is nice. In the pantry. Yeah, this kitchen is nice as shit. Nice. This is nice. Okay. Hey gang, Graham Jacket checking in. Thank you for returning to my vlog. As you can see, I am in an empty space. I am bringing you guys along with me to a go apartment slash townhome slash house hunting with me, guys. I'm going to need y'all help. Really, I don't because I know what I like. I know what I want. But I want you guys to come along on the journey so you can see what I like and what I want. And you get to be there to see what I end up getting. So, this is going to be my official first apartment hunt tour what is so girl this is the front door this is where we walk it in this is where we walk in and as soon as you get in to the left there's a small space i wouldn't make this a bedroom i would make this more like my little office space it's cute the ceiling fan looks very nice now as you can see it ain't central air there's air conditioners in here. Ain't too bad, ain't too bad. But the doors, the doorknobs, all of this look classy. I'm digging it, I'm digging it. And then it has the, you could control the air with a remote control. I'm liking it. So when you come in here, you got the bathroom. As you can see, nice little bathroom. This is a cute sink. So, so far, you could tell that they spent some good money. It's a little crooked now. They a little off with it, but it ain't bad looking. High ceilings, nice light fixtures. Fixtures. It has a shower downstairs. So that might can be a bedroom. It'll be super small, but that could pass for a bedroom now. I will have my guests stay down there. But I like this. I like this. What door is this? Okay. The little hot water room. And then this space here. Yeah. Now I most definitely make this my living room. It ain't too big, but it ain't that small. And it's cute for the aesthetic. We got backyard. It's a little small. Little porch that you step out to. But it ain't bad. It's cute. It's cute. But so far, so cute. So far, so cute. And then we got the steps. Ta-da! We have the kitchen. Now the kitchen is spacious, spacious as fuck. I can see myself cooking at my on my island. I ain't gonna flex, y'all. I'ma tap into cooking more. I would do some cooking videos for y'all if I end up settling for this apartment. When I say this apartment is super affordable, it's cute. It's a reason why I had to come back to Chattanooga because I feel like in Chattanooga my roots is here and I just prosper. It was a little, it was a little difficult in Atlanta. Then we got the nice ass silver refrigerator. See, my worst fear was that I would settle for an apartment that has a white refrigerator. For some reason, white refrigerator is just out of date to me. So, nah, I ain't interested in getting a white refrigerator. I absolutely love the cabinets. Cause I definitely keep my Forks and spoons in here, shit. Nah, nah. I love the color of the kitchen. It's just so clean looking. So this is a brand new hall. The pantry space, super big. 
Voila! Now who you know already got a washer and dryer in a place without having to go buy it? I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. And I will make this another... I'll make this like a dining space, but I'll also put like a TV in here so we could chill. And what's this, the patio? Oh yeah, look at that view. I'll sit out here. Then you get the view of the mountains. This is nice. I'm liking this so far, y'all. And when I say it's super affordable, I'm digging this. Alright. I'm close as you. Okay, damn, my bad. Now we're about to go to a place I haven't visited yet. The third floor. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Come through ceiling. Oh, this is the bedroom. Oh, this is cute, cute. Now, y'all know I'm gonna need more closet space than this, but look at the ceiling. I put some shit up there. I stand some shit up there. This is nice. Let me turn the light on. What's this? Okay, I'll make this the linen closet. This is nice. This is definitely a great start for my bachelor pad. This is cute. Okay. The tub ain't too, too basic. Oh, no way, somebody did live here. What the hell is that? Somebody must have lived here for at least a year because these were just built. But it still smells brand new. Okay. Okay. All right. I see a little homey home. Homey home away from home. Another patio? Nah, for real. I'll come out here and meditate. Oh God, I'll be out here meditating. I might sleep out here some nights too. I'll put me like a little screen right there to keep the like the, the bugs from coming through. But this view is everything. Oh yeah, I might have to, I might have to see what it's hitting for. This is sexy as shit. All right, y'all, on a scale of one through 10, how do y'all rate this uh, townhome? What I do like about it is that it's three stories. It has two patios. It has open floor concept. It has the island that I like in the kitchen because I hate being feeling like I'm standing in one space. It has a spacious brand new refrigerator like that's up date, up to date. Like, look at the handles. The handle is right here. Like, that's fly as shit. So we like the refrigerator. We like the, the fact that it has washer and dryer. I like the fact that it has um, a cover on top of the patio, so I don't have to worry about getting rained on. I love the fact that there's a shower downstairs and a small room downstairs, so if I decided to have guests, Guess what? They don't have to come up here other than to eat or if we're going to be sitting, you know, up here like in the dining area where I said I was going to make this like a little entertainment uh, place as well. But downstairs is also going to be a little room as well. So we got two different spaces for entertainment upstairs or downstairs. There's no reason for nobody to be upstairs in my room because we said I'm on my celibate shit. 
still ain't had sex, and I'm actually celebrating one full month without sex. So I know everybody go ahead and check up the ones down below, cause I'm I'm staying clear. I don't want to have no other energy on me going into my new house. I want to make a decision based off of how I feel and just solely off of me. And this is pretty much about to be my first time in a long time in the last 13 years since I've lived by myself. Uh, and we know my relationship before last, you know, took up quite a few bit of those years. Um, we do like the windows. I love the the fact that it's bright. And the house is facing where the sun can come in. I always, I feel like a plus is natural lighting for me. I love the fact that the lighting is up top. Um, I would definitely change the light bulbs though because I like white lights. I like daylight, light, LED lights. Um, the appliances is silver. That's another plus because I absolutely hate white refrigerators. Um, yeah, so tell me how you guys like it. I need you guys to comment down below. I need you to go ahead and keep, like, follow me on this journey. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my house hunting. Um, this side, this side. But we ain't going to settle just yet. I want to get, like, my best top three options and then figure out where I go from there, okay? But I appreciate you guys watching. Go ahead and thumbs this video up. Comment down below. You gotta go.